This is Canopus, the great beacon of the southern constellation Carina. Canopus is the second brightest star in the night sky, and unlike Sirius, the brightest star, whose brilliance comes from its closeness, Canopus shines from a far greater distance, around 310 light years away. Its light began its journey long before we examined it with telescopes. Canopus is an A-type supergiant, a star far larger and far more luminous than our own sun. Its bright white glow comes from its high temperature and tremendous energy output. As a supergiant, Canopus is already in a later chapter in its life. It's an evolved star that has expanded and brightened after exhausting the hydrogen in its core. When astronomers classify stars, we place them on the Hertzsprung-Russell diagram, a map of temperature, luminosity, and color. So let's look where Canopus falls on the HR diagram. It appears above the main sequence band in the region of supergiants. These stars have expanded dramatically and shine with tens of thousands of suns worth of luminosity. Its position there reflects its immense brightness and advanced stage of stellar evolution. Finding Canopus depends on where you live. If you live in the southern hemisphere, Canopus dominates the summer sky. It's unmistakable and high overhead. In the northern hemisphere, especially in the mid-latitudes, it sits very low on the southern horizon during the winter months. The easiest method to find it is to find Sirius and sweep your gaze downward towards the horizon. If you're far enough south, the next bright white star you encounter will be Canopus. The sky reveals itself slowly, and with practice, Canopus becomes a star your eyes will recognize instinctively. If this journey through the stars inspires you, Canopus is just the second of the 25 brightest stars I explore in my book, Starry Wonders. Be sure to grab your copy of Starry Wonders today.